in New York, six hour electro optics. I want to give you a, a brief uh, tutorial on how to configure a digital ballistic reticle with the Sierra 3 rifle scope in the event that you don't yet own a Kilo BDX rangefinder, uh, or for some reason you prefer that day to use a traditional holdover style reticle um, that's static, that's not directly tied uh, to, to the distance that you're ranging. So to do that, you're gonna go into the sights tab. Again, your, your uh, rifle scope has to be turned on uh, for it to be discovered. You know that's happened because it's in blue at the top of the screen, so we're actively communicating to the scope. And when you hit this tab, you're gonna see this reticle. Uh, if you turn this ballistic reticle mode on, then you'll see that it lights up um, and you'll see all the holes that are now illuminated in the rifle scope. So when you look through the rifle scope, this is what you'll see on the reticle right now. So in this case, we're in fixed hold uh, and it's an MOA style reticle. Uh, you can change it from MOA to mills. Uh, you can take it from fixed holds to ballistic holds. So you may just wanna set up uh, a reticle uh, in 100 yard increments in this case. You can turn these off with the radio buttons. Maybe you don't want an 800 yard. I'm not gonna take a 700 yard shot. Uh, maybe I'm only going to shoot to 500. Maybe I'm going to shoot out to 550. You can change the value at 550. And now that's a, a 550 yard hold. The, the radio tabs don't change position. The dots on the wire do. Again, that's what that reticle will look like uh, in, in the rifle scope. One thing to keep in mind, we call this a digital focal plane rifle scope. The Sierra 3 has a digital focal plane. What does that mean? The reticle's on the second focal plane, uh, but because we're automatically scaling the reticle with the magnification, the power selector, um, it's gonna scale that reticle to subtend at any zoom level. And that is how a front focal plane scope performs. So it basically performs the functionality of a front focal plane scope on the second focal plane. Hence, we call it a digital focal plane. So then uh, you say, hey, I wanna go back and I wanna use it. Uh, maybe with a Kilo BDX rangefinder, you shut that reticle off and now the ballistic reticle is off and now we're in direct communication again with the rangefinder and the reticle will only illuminate the appropriate hold for the target that, uh, that you ranged at distance. And that's a quick uh, tutorial on the ballistic reticle function of the Sierra 3 rifle scope.